In this video, I'm going to show you how you can save previous year's curriculums in a document form that you can then use to reference or to print off. So we're going to be using RenWeb1 for this video. So having logged in, I'm going to click on my left-hand menu. I'm going to go down to Report Manager. Now what I'm going to look for is I want to use Lesson Plan Homework. Now I've used set this into my favorites because it's one that I use quite a lot. Um, if you don't have it here, that's okay. I let's see, this is in class, no course, lesson plan. Yep, there it is. Under grade book, it's in lesson plan homework. Now the key thing you want to remember is if you're printing off curriculum from uh, the previous year, you want to first select a year's past. So since this is currently the 2017-2018 school year, I don't want that. So if I'm going to look back to last year, I'm going to look at 2016-2017. And so let's say I want to print off a class from first semester. So I have to set my calendar back to 2016. And it started around April 15th or so. And it ended around about Christmas time, so about December 22nd. And so I'll select this and drag it over. Now we have two options here. We can either print it. Now what it will do is it will open a new window and it will show you this as a web page. Now you can save this. If I right click and click Save As, I can save this on my computer or I can go back and click Print PDF. This is a new feature in RenWeb 1 as of 2017. And now you can save it as a very nice PDF file. The one thing to keep in mind though is that this will not always render nicely if you uh, give homework assignments that are very wordy. So let me take off Algebra 3. That obviously didn't have that problem. Let's look at statistics. Whoops, wrong dates for that. Let's try this statistics. Mm -hmm. Now this one renders really nicely as a web page, but let's try and print it as a PDF. Now as a PDF, because I put in so many words in here, it's not going to render very nicely. It doesn't wrap the text around in each cell. So PDF is a nice option and one that I'm going to use a lot, but in some cases like this, you have to shorten your homework assignments in order for it to look like this as opposed to this. Hope this helps. Uh, if you're looking for other advice or other things you want to do with RenWeb1, please write them in the comments below and we'll, we'll make another video for you. Thanks.